here with it. 55? Okay, so this is... Okay, well, this, yeah, this would have been about uh, 63, I imagine. Yeah. But, uh, anyway, for the story, uh, I attended college classes on the base that I was assigned to, uh, in which I took a number of courses, eventually graduating from the University of Maryland. Uh, so Maryland had a visiting professor. My favorite professor of all time was a man named Dr. Oswald, who was an Alsatian, which was between France and Germany, Germany and France, so they were sort of binational. Anyway, his story was, he wasn't a Nazi, but the recruiting officer said that they were going to send his testicles to OCS and he could join them if he wished. That was his story. That was his story about why he was a, a German and he submarine said captain. That, yes, he thought is he would follow his testicles to OCS. So he OCS did, is what? What's uh, OCS stand for? German. But what's OCS stand for? Officer's Candidate School. Oh, okay. All right, go ahead. Officer's Candidate School. So anyway, he did and served toward the end of the war, very much toward the end of the war, in a German U-boat as a U-boat officer he had been trained. As a submarine. Uh, the other visiting professor, and other visiting professor, who taught English, grammar, that sort of thing, uh, basic uh, courses required for all students, was British and had served in the British Navy during the war. So uh, anyway, there was the still the British and the Germans. Anyway, when they met in the hall, they never spoke, but they exchanged salutes. End of story. It's a great story, Dad. It's great. They never spoke the whole time. They just. But they'd still salute each other. That's crazy.